What is the one thing your visitors have to do on your WooCommerce store to be able to buy your products? Well, it's visiting your product page and click on that buy button. And to be sure that people visit that page, you have to have a clickworthy product title. And how can you know your product title is clickworthy? Well, that's what I'll show you in this video. Hi, my name is Hanne from Thrive Teams, and in this video I'm going to show you how you can be sure that you are using the most clickworthy titles for your products. One of the first decisions that you will have to make when you choose the title of your products is will you be choosing a descriptive title that's kind of boring but really clear, or will you go for a more creative title that has more branding but that might be not so clear for your visitors? And the answer is, there is no right answer. Let's take a look at what OPI is doing, for example. They have really interesting titles, really interesting color titles for their products. And on their own website, they use only this color title as the product title for their articles. The product title will, for example, be Charmy and Sugar. But when you see the products of OPI on the Amazon store, you can see that Charmy and Sugar is only one of the components that they will put in the title at the end and in brackets. So for sure, not the most important element. They will use a much more descriptive title. So what should you do on your store? Well, again, there's no right answer. You should test it. Thrive Headline Optimizer allows you to A-B test each one of your product titles. You will discover which one gets the most click-throughs, which one gets the most engagement, and the plugin can even automatically choose the best one for you. This means that after a while you will only have the best titles on your shop and get the most people to your product pages. Once you've installed and activate the Drive Headline Optimizer, you will be able to start optimizing immediately the titles of the products you already have on your website. Let's take a look how that is done. First, go to the Drive dashboard and choose Drive Headline Optimizer. From here, you will be able to add new tests to your existing products. Click on Add New. Here you can choose what type of content you want to create a new A-B test for. So you have posts, pages, or what interests us now is products. Choose products. The product title I want to optimize is the one from Charmy and Sugar. I can click on it and it goes to the list of content to be tested. From here, click on save and continue. As you can see, the original title is Charmy and Sugar, so that's the name of the color of the product, and I will add a variation. And I will also add a second one. Now that I've chosen the titles that I want to A-B test, I click on Determine Test Criteria. From here, I have the choice to stay with the default settings and start the test immediately, or I can choose my own engagement settings. The fastest way to get started is to go with the default settings and click on Start Test. As you can see, the new test has been added and we will be able to start seeing which title gets the most engagement and the most clicks. Let me show you what this looks like. I opened the website in an incognito window so that I could show you what this testing looks like. So as you can see here on the category page, I can see that this title is still Charmy and Sugar, so it's showing me the first title. And here, this is another test that I've running with three different titles. You can see 102 bottle storage rack. When somebody now clicks on the product details and goes to your product details page, this is registered as one click for this title. As you can see, of course, the title stays the same between the category page and then the product page, and even here, on the related products, they will always see the same title. Now I open the website in another browser, also in incognito mode, to show you how this could look like for another visitor of your website. So you can see that here it's written sparkly pink nail polish and that the 102 bottle storage rack became neat and organized. So we are testing different titles on these different products so that the plugin can show me which one is the best and optimize all of the product titles on the website. Now, this is how you optimize products you already have on your website, but you can also, the moment you create a new product, immediately start an A-B test. Let me show you. Let's see products add product. 
And here you will see the outline that you're used to seeing. So you can choose your first product name and you can simply click on add new headline to start testing variations. Once you have a test running, you will be able to see which title is getting the most engagement. Here, as you can see, I have two active tests. And when we take a look at the results, we're able to see that for the moment, the title that got the most engagement is the title that's called Nail Polish Storage Rack. If you choose the default settings, then the automatic winner settings will be enabled. So this means that actually you have nothing to do anymore. As soon as there's enough engagement and enough data, the plugin will choose which headline is the winner and will set it automatically. But at any time, you can yourself stop the test and choose a new winner. Now I can hear you thinking, okay, this is super cool. I can show different titles to different visitors, but what about SEO? And let me show you that actually the Drive Headline Optimizer doesn't affect your SEO at all. When you look at a product page, you will understand immediately. This is the title that we are testing and that we are showing different variations to different visitors. But as you can see, we do not change the URL of the product and we do not change the meta title tag. So this means that you will actually have the possibility to have the best title for SEO and the most engaging title for your visitors. Now it's your turn to start using Thrive Headline Optimizer to get the best titles on your WooCommerce shop. And if you have any questions or comments, you can leave them below this video.